Hey, City Point, this video is long overdue. Between the holidays and the family getting the flu, it just took a little bit longer, but we got to it now, and uh, we wanna give you guys an update on what happened this year with the coat drive. First off, we wanna send out a huge thank you to Elite Cleaners in Fayetteville. We took the coats that you guys donated here at the building uh, to them, and they uh, dry cleaned them up for us. So let's hear from Pastor Jim Bob. Hey, we're here at Elite Cleaners, and we just wanted to say thank you so very much You're for welcome. what you've done. We're gonna take it to the Treehouse um, Pantry that does both food and clothes. And oh, so awesome. what you've been able to do, will be able to uh, be, give warm clothes to a whole, a whole bunch of people. Well, that's good. I'm, we're, I'm, we're glad that we could help. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. In the past, we've been able to partner with Fayetteville Public Schools and uh, get our coats donated there. This year, they said that they had a bunch of coats come in and that they didn't really need them. And we knew God had a plan for where these coats needed to be. And so we found a new partner that's very, very close to home. Check this out. Hey, you see where we are? Treehouse Pantry. Y'all, this is just like two blocks north of us. It's so perfect. So we gave them the coats and they do a whole lot of things with Springdale Public Schools. I think this is where we need to partner in so many things. So they've got our coats. Thanks, guys. Again, we want to say a huge thank you to everyone involved, to you guys for donating your coats. We had overflowing trash cans. I think it ended up being 40 coats in all. We want to say thank you again to Elite Cleaners for taking those coats, cleaning them up and getting them ready. And then again to the Treehouse Food Pantry for serving the needs of our community. We want to be a church that serves and gives and we know that you guys' hearts are in it. So we look forward to what God has in store for us in this community in the future. We'll see you guys later.